Authentic Christianity What it is and what it's not, according to its sources. Authentic Christianity What it is according to its sources. Messiah Jesus All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all that I have commanded you. And behold, I am with you always, to the end of the age. The Apostle Peter His divine power has granted to us all things that pertain to life and godliness through the knowledge of him who called us to his own glory and excellence, by which he has granted to us his precious and very great promises, so that through them you may become partakers of the divine nature, having escaped from the corruption that is in the world because of sinful desire. The Apostle Paul The fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control, against such things there is no law. And those who belong to Christ Jesus have crucified the flesh with its passions and desires. If we live by the Spirit, let us also keep in step with the Spirit. The Apostle James if anyone thinks he is religious and does not bridle his tongue but deceives his heart, this person's religion is worthless. Religion that is pure and undefiled before God the Father is this, to visit orphans and widows in their affliction, and to keep oneself unstained from the world. The Apostle John A new commandment I give to you that you love one another, just as I have loved you, you also are to love one another. By this all people will know that you are my disciples, if you have love for one another. The Apostle Jude You, beloved, building yourselves up in your most holy faith and praying in the Holy Spirit, keep yourselves in the love of God waiting for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ that leads to eternal life. The Book of Acts They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and the fellowship, to the breaking of bread and the prayers, and awe came upon every soul, and many wonders and signs were being done through the apostles, and all who believed were together and had all things in common. The Book of Hebrews This makes Jesus the guarantor of a better covenant. He holds his priesthood permanently, because he continues forever. Consequently, he is able to save to the uttermost those who draw near to God through him, since he always lives to make intercession for them. The Book of Revelation Here is a call for the endurance of the saints those who keep the commandments of God and their faith in Jesus. And I heard a voice from heaven saying, Write this, Blessed are the dead who die in the Lord from now on. Blessed indeed, says the Spirit, that they may rest from their labors, for their deeds follow them. Authentic Christianity, what it's not. Neither Jesus nor his apostles spoke or wrote about the following. Buildings dedicated to religious activities. Vestments, bells, prayer books, images or candles. Holy days, holy sites, holy men or pilgrimages. Tax-exempt societies and organizations. Choirs, musicales or worship teams clerics, collections, tithes or salaries, monks, nuns, orders or convents, clergy, ordination, celibacy or laymen, crusades, marches, flags and fanfare. 
holy wars, inquisitions, or ecclesial courts. Such practices and objects have made Christianity a religion like all the others.